In 1789, a bay colt named Figure was born. A colt that would become the founding stallion for an entire breed. He became known by his owner's name, Justin Morgan. Standing just over 14 hands, Justin Morgan's horse was powerful and strong. He was known to out-trot, outrun, and out-pull any horse he was put against. They used him a lot for breeding and found that all of his offspring looked and acted just like him. Um, it didn't matter what mare he was bred to. Well, Morgans are still known for their high-stepping action, um, just their up-headedness. Sure. Um, so they hold their heads up pretty high, they're very proud of themselves, um, and they're just very expressive horses. And They're well known for their versatility. They are the official state animal of Vermont, and the official state horse of Massachusetts. The registry motto is the horse that chooses you. And with over 80,000 registered Morgans living in several different countries, it looks like a lot of equestrians have liked that choice. Um, they're just so easy to get along with and they're very, um, I don't wanna just say spunky, but they're very energetic. Yes. And, just happy to do things with yeah. you. Yeah. So, yeah. Awesome. That's got to be my favorite thing. Very cool. Hey everyone, thanks for watching. Having the University of Vermont Morgan Horse Farm as part of the quest was so much fun. And if you ever find yourself in the state of Vermont, it is definitely a place that I suggest you check out. A huge thank you to my patrons. You guys are amazing. I couldn't do this without you. And we're at breed number 24 with the Morgan Horse. Remember to send any suggestions my way for upcoming breeds. We've got a lot more fun horses to ride. I'll see you soon.